let's talk for a minute about happiness and uh, the whole idea of happy, 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 happy. <laughs> to have, have you ever, you know, really stopped to, to look at what does that mean? Uh, generally, our conditioning has been that we'll be happy when something happens. Uh, can you, uh, you can relate to that. I mean, and it's subtle. It, it really is subtle. Sometimes it's not so subtle, but, you know, we'll be happy if we have the right government or we'll be happy if we, you know, we're in the right relationship or we'll be happy if um, we have X amount of dollars in the bank or <clears throat> we'll be happy if our health is a certain way. Uh, you know, we'll be happy if our children behave uh, the way we want them to and, and do the things that we think they should or, you know, we'll be happy, right? When I lose X amount of pounds, I'll be happy. Um, and uh, so it's, it's conditional. We, we, we look at happiness and we say, well, yes, but, yes, but. And, and uh, um, I, I'm here to say that... Uh, Happiness, it, there's it, in that in that domain that 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 area of wanting or desire. There's it's it never happens. It's very fleeting. It's like it's you know it's just and so we're always looking uh, for something to make us happy. The next vacation. I mean, we have these moments, say when uh, when when maybe we get it, we're on a trip or you know we're. we're we're excited about something, you know, or we have a great meal, or we're, we're in good company, where we where we feel, you know, content and and, and uh, but my uh, experience is that happiness can only be found in the moment, and mostly, and this is my experience as well. Mostly, most of my life, I I. I was like, well, yes, of course, I'm here. and But I wasn't here. I wasn't aware enough to know that I wasn't here. I was still caught up in a story. And uh, so if we're attached to an identity, we're not generally here. And, you know, our identity is can be very uh, subtle. Uh, you know, we can be doctor so-and-so. So we become an identity, you know, we... <clears throat> We, we start a business, we become totally um, identified with that business. I've done those things. Um, we, uh, you know, we get in recovery. We become identified with, with recovery. We, 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 uh, so, so we're not really here in, in, in that instance either. We're, we're, it's not the simpleness of ourselves. We're, we're this, and then we want to be seen in a certain way. And, and uh, the beautiful thing about starting to practice being here now, and we're going to do a little practice in a second, um, um, of like a little, almost like a little meditation where I'm going to help you drop into the moment, is that we get to leave everything behind. All the uh, stories of, you know, who owes you money or who you owe money to or, uh, you know, Everything, and just we just let it go. Our concerns about health, our concerns about aging, um, you know, our concerns about whether our husband's going to move out or not, or you know, all kinds of things. Whether she's going to leave you or not, and um, we just we actually in the moment, all of that disappears. Now we can pick it back up after, but it just literally disappears. It's doesn't exist and 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 for us for you know we can go into that space where we're really here and uh, there's there's lots of ways to to drop into the now but in the now there's peace in the now and peace i guess kind of trumps uh happiness doesn't it it's you know it's beyond happiness there's peace there's joy there's uh mm, gratitude a sense of gratitude that's beyond uh, a gratitude for things. It, uh, you know, often we do a gratitude list. It's about the things we think we have. And I'm grateful that I've lived enough years to see a lot of things come and go. 
relationships come and go all everything changes it, there's nothing permanent in this in this domain and and uh, but in the moment is the true permanence the true oneness and and uh, um, and the true freedom so um, who wants to be free who wants to be free god beautiful eh <laughs> okay so let's do this for a minute right um, and uh, and and wow it's telling me that i don't have any power left in my phone in my deal so we're going to try and do this without losing connection it says my mac will sleep unless it's plugged into a power outlet <gasps> how did i do that so let's drop into this moment <coughs> just drop in now just you know be in our body just be in our breath just let go of everything all the stories all the imagining right and wrong all the good and bad just let it all go drop into this moment with the breath include the sounds around us in my case there's sounds of the wind in the trees the birds are close truly drop into our body to our breath be here now Freedom is only in this moment, in this breath, in this voice. The breath. Feel your feet on the floor. Practice. Practice being here now. You need to just stay in that calm space, and I'm going to read from the Bhagavad uh, from the Tao Te Ching. Sorry, from the Tao Te Ching, chapter 57. I love this. This, this is a, a uh, translation by uh, Stephen Mitchell. Just stay in that space, that open space, while I read with you and make this part of your moment. It says, if you want to be a great leader, you must learn to follow the Tao. Stop trying to control. Let go of fixed plans and concepts. The world will govern itself. The more prohibitions you have, the less virtuous people will be. Virtuous people will be. The more weapons you have, the less secure people will feel. The more subsidies you have, the less self-reliant people will be. Therefore, the Master says, let go of the law, and people become honest. Let go of economics, and people become prosperous. Let go of religion, and people become serene. Let go of all desire for common good, and the good becomes common as grass. I love this, the Tao Te Ching. So be here now, practice this, you may call it meditation, you may call it what you want, but focus on this moment, letting go of all, everything. If fear comes up, just breathe into it, be with it, let it go. If anger comes up, just let it go. The more of us practice this being here now, the more elevated we become. We move into our natural state, which is a state of love, and a state of peace, and a state of serenity. Our natural being. Okay, love you guys. Love to hear from you. Love you if you go to my YouTube channel and subscribe. We're growing this thing, baby. Be here now. Hmm. Love you.